Uh, I'm here with Andrew Hill from STARS. And, Andrew, we've just been uh, learning what uh, STAR actually stands for, but um, one of the other things that kids can, can do, they, they can get out and get, get engaged, but then they can spread the word, I suppose. They, they can go and have a look at themselves on television, can't they? They can. It's um, a internet te- television yep. with a concept, and the idea is to then get it as a kids' TV show. But at the moment, it is actually a workable TV on the internet called Stars TV. Yep. So you catch the stars, and if you catch us, then you see yourself on Stars TV. Wonderful. And that's where I, mean, I can't remember the stats I was looking at last last week, but um, uh, the number of people watching free to air television now is is down below twenty percent. Most most people these days just doing dial on demand. Look, and it's probably one getting rid of ads, but two getting. Um your interest when you want it. That's right. Getting yeah. what you what you want to see when you want to see. Yeah. It. And and this way the kids can see can see their area or their their locale or their What's community. The, they can see themselves when yeah. they want it. But the amazing thing is they'll go on and watch themselves a hundred times, right. and they'll show their friends, and that's where it starts turning into a, a bit of a frenzy. Right. Narcissism. Yes, I love it. <laughs> <laughs> um, but. It's not only themselves, they can have a look at others as well because there's a whole lot of channels there when I was looking at it. What I did is I go through and have a look at very positive uh, experiences that are on video, someone who has done some amazing special thing in their life and you take a copy and you can inspire other people through showing them someone else's successes. Right. So... um what were you? You were talking to me a couple of weeks ago about um, a, 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 like a almost like a Hunger Games type concept. What's what's that about? We're putting in Sydney Olympic Park. First time it's been done this holidays. I'll choose the best sports person, boy and girl in primary, boy and girl in high school, and your captain. I'm trying to get the mayors to come on board. So there's your hunger theme idea and they'll go through a whole series of sports skills right at the end of it we'll say and the winner is and i'm trying to get Parramatta, canada bay hunters hill ride and auburn right. together so they're the areas around anyone's welcome to come in and you don't have to bring your own mayor i'm sure we'll get some <laughs> representative from the council <laughs> but uh, the main thing is if you feel you're up to it send us a line come along there's a big community day first for everyone to try out right. and then the uh, the stars of the day will then go on to another section where everyone's still playing but they'll be playing off for points and trying to be the sports star of that event and so this this will um, this will th- these these children will be representing their school and the school will be you know very welcome to come down and provide a whole lot of noisy support I guess I wouldn't be surprised if it nearly goes the other way we're right. starting at the state level right so I've asked the minister to come okay yeah be, I'm trying to make it big photo shoot in front of the cauldron ask the mayors in ask the kids from each of the communities in and then i wouldn't be surprised if someone will go into their local area let's uh let's start practicing and then that'll go back to the school schools let's start practicing we want to fly our flag if it's you right. so it'll start getting more kids being more active wonderful what a great great initiative yeah getting getting kids involved look it's um the adults have already come to me saying, what about us? So I will do a corporate one as well. And there's, you know, things like golf putting, uh, tennis rallies, targeting and things like that. Right. Yep. Branding. Branding's is good, but we use soft balls so we don't maim anyone. Oh, that's yep. no fun. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Not medicine balls. Yes. Uh, so um, if anybody's listening and is, in, is wanting to know more information, how do they get in touch with uh, get in touch with you? They can ring 044 Stars TV, right. so that's the mobile, or starstv.net, right. and that'll come straight to us. And I will be doing some ads in the community papers to say, we want you, and just to get people active. And you might surprise yourself what sort of skills you do have, and you might represent your council. So if you're a parent listening to this and you, you think your kids could benefit, they get in touch with you. Yes. And if you're a, a parent um, that may not know much about this, the chances are that the kids are going to be dragging you along anyway, so, so look out for it. And um, what will happen is the kids will drag you along, not to spectate. They'll be having a go. Yes. There will be one rep from each area, boy and girl, and that's like your cheer squad. Yes. They're going, go ride or go Parramatta, and the idea is to get a little bit of that 
clubby mentality mm. where you're um, going together and you're trying to spur on the person representing your area. Wonderful. Well, Andrew Hill, thank you very much for coming on the show. And um, maybe after the um, after this uh, t- tournament's finished, get get you back in and give us a bit of a report. That, that'd be great and uh, very uh, um, traditional when we just see the end of the Commonwealth Games. So yeah, yeah. thank you. Uh, that was-